Hello and welcome everyone to the um, summary of turn 14 of my solo playthrough play of my Memoir 44 double breakthrough map scenario called Force vs. Finesse on the Battle of Duno Brody of uh, summer 1941. Um, as you can see, the well, as I told you before, the victory conditions are 24 victory points and the Germans are only one point away. The Russians are at 19. And um, to be honest, the Germans actually already reached 24, but what I forgot to mention, and that was actually the intent from the beginning, is that it would be a condition that have to be, would have to be met at the uh, start of a player turn, and the Germans did have it at the, uh, well, during their player turn, uh, and at the end of it too, but the Russians uh, reclaimed it on their turn. So I really want uh, the winning side, at least if the win happens in this way and not by sudden death, um, that uh, that it be controlled at the start of their turn. So the uh, Russians actually retook a town hex, uh, thereby, um, well, nullifying the win for now, postponing it probably. Uh, the Germans played uh, medics and mechanics, and the Russians played uh, two in the center and two in the move. Uh, the Germans also got uh, a truck reinforcement, um, this was the consequence of um, the ground reinforcement role. This tank reclaimed a figure. Um, uh, I may have actually forgotten to attack with it. I'm not sure. Oh, maybe I didn't. Anyway, it attacked the KV-1, but to no avail. Same goes for that infantry unit. Uh, on the Russian turn, the KV counterattacked, but didn't cause too many casualties either. I think it attacked the tanks twice, hoping to score... Two hits uh, spread out over two attacks. The first one didn't cause any hits, did it cause a flag, but then no hits were caused on the um, on the armor overrun. Um, German unit retook the town. I believe that's what it was that gave them 24 victory points. But as I said, uh, the intent was uh, from the beginning to um, have 24 points at the beginning of, of one's turn. And... Um, the Russians actually, uh, well, they didn't reclaim it, obviously, because uh, the Germans are still in possession. But something must have happened uh, on the other, yeah, on the other map, actually, um, that caused it not to go ahead. As you can see, um, <coughs> the Russians, excuse me, uh, did roll a, a lot of. They actually got. I may have left that one from the previous round. I'm not sure. Uh, so. Either they got a reinforcement uh, truck and a couple of uh, on the moves, which was actually very helpful for them. Um, so they moved up quite a few units close to the front. Um, and these were the two regular on the moves. So the uh, artillery unit moved back into Lutsk and the uh, supported armor moved forward. And um, this one was ordered by the medics and mechanics because it had two figures at the start of the German turn, but the Russians did cause one hit, but didn't cause it to retreat. Uh, on the other board, uh, the Germans played an infantry assault, and the Russians played a medics and mechanics. Now, the Russians were a lot less fortunate with their uh, role for the medics and mechanics. They only, they only rolled a star, and uh, that meant that they got to reinforce... Um, one of their elite armor units which was down to two figures and they gave it another figure but they moved into the town and that way they weren't allowed to battle anymore even if they had uh, there was nothing in sight this is what the russians did with and on the move here uh, because of the ground reinforcement role they reclaimed brody and that brought the germans back to 23 victory points um now, what else did the Germans do? As I said, they played an infantry assault. I couldn't really find a definitive answer on the internet, nor in the frequently asked questions, nor in the rule books. But it seems to me that uh, supply trucks um, can resupply instead of battling, uh, which they can't normally do. That is, they don't roll, roll dice, but it would happen on the battle phase of, of, of a turn. So uh, since both of them moved into... Uh, terrain that doesn't allow uh, a unit to battle anymore. I just assumed it would mean that they weren't allowed to resupply anymore either. I could I, I could understand they would be too busy doing other stuff, you know. <laughs> so um, so I, I so I probably played that correctly. But if somebody could um, could uh, 
clear that up once and for all, that would be great, because again, I couldn't find anything definitive on it. I, I did see something related to half tracks, which of course work quite similarly. Um, but I think I played that correctly anyway. I was allowed to order four infantry units, supply trucks count as infantry. So as far as that's concerned, they were certainly allowed to be ordered. Um, but I think the fact that they moved into uh, terrain that would normally prevent a unit from battling, I just assumed it would prevent uh, supply trucks and half tracks from resupplying as well. Uh, this was the other supply truck that was ordered, and uh, this infantry unit, well, that one scored a hit for the Germans. It attacked the Russian infantry that was there and eliminated it, eliminated it by rolling a flag uh, because it had nowhere to retreat. Um, so that kind of sums up turn 14 oh, oh, over here as well. This wasn't on the move for the Germans. They uh, moved their artillery forward, and um, yeah. That sums it up. Thank you for watching again and see you on turn 15 and maybe that one will bring definitive victory.